Bwana Yesu asifiwe asifiwe tena familia ya baba wetu mzee Temesi akiwemo rafiki yangu Richard waheshimiwa mawaziri mheshimiwa gavana wetu mheshimiwa ndugu mdavadi mheshimiwa wabunge wazee wa jamii na viongozi wote ambao wako hapa mheshimiwa Noah Kesa siju yuko kama mheshimiwa Gumo na mtambua MCA wetu wa chama chetu ambaye ni MCA wa hapa Bwana Kaburu Mimi nimekuja kama nimechelewa kidogo kwa sababu ndege tuliyotoka nayo Nairobi ili develop mechanical problems angani ikarudi kwa airport wakabadilisha ingine ndivyo tukachelewa Huyu mzee ni baba yetu Yeye wamezaliwa karibu mwaka mmoja na baba yangu baba yangu anamshilia miaka miwili peke yake na yeye huwa ananiita kijana yangu kila tukikutana hajawahi kuniita jina huwa ananiita tu kijana yangu na ni mzee wa heshima heshima kubwa sana kwa jamii yetu kwa nchi yetu kazi aliyoifanya na tunashukuru mama kwa kumlinda mzee mpaka wakati ameenda kwa Mungu kazi yake inajulikana heshima yake inatambulika miaka kadhaa iliyopita mzee alituita kwake rural home butere kama viongozi wa jamii yetu wengine wako hapa tulikuwa nao akatoaambia kwanza mkija kwangu msifikiri mnaniletea hela yoyote hata ya kumulisha akatuchinjia ngombe akatukalisha chini akasema mambo mengi sana ya kuunganisha watu wetu akatuambia kama vijana wetu wa jamii ya mlembe hamtakuwa na maana yoyote na wakenya wengine kama nyinyi wenyewe hamuungani that is the mzee lying here today two weeks ago or three huyo mheshimiwa Chris alinipigia simu alikuwa ameenda kuona mzee nikaongea na mzee kwa simu ya Chris sikujua pia is my last time to communicate with our patriarch na message yake ilikuwa ni ile ile muungane muunganishe watu tuwe na usalama katika nchi yetu and we will live to that building to carry his legacy forward sisi kama chama cha Ford Kenya we are the government in Transoya here na tunatambua kwamba Transoya is a mini Kenya ndio kwa sababu kura iliyopita hata kama jamii ya kutuny hatukupata mbunge wala MCA we went out of our way to nominate mama moja anaitwa Masi Tanui to join the Fort Kenya team to continue bringing our people together so i want to urge that to respect what mzee stood for the leaders here assembled to endelee kuleta watu wetu pamoja let's emphasize more and more on things that bring us together and less and less on things that divide us that is the legacy for this mzee na washukuru wabunge wa national assembly 
wabunge wetu wa Fort Kenya tunawashukuru wote walipiga kura ya ndio kwa BBI Senate itapiga kura yake on Tuesday and I want to tell Kenyans that a constitution is a living organ is a living document it continuously turns from good to better better to best as we go to the future so zile vitu ambazo azimo there will always be an opportunity to include them at a later stage but hatua kwa hatua the most important in this BBI ni ile pesa inakuja mashinani yenye ndugu yangu yuji na mesungumuzia with 35% of our national revenues coming to the counties Transoya will not go to queue in Nairobi to tarmac roads here they can do it on their own we will see Transoya building tea factories if it is well managed we will see Transoya building milling plants for maize so that as a number one producer of cereal maize in Kenya your maize should leave Transoya with value addition to the market out there that is how to create wealth Baba Skofu tunashukuru na familia Richard and brothers and sisters for Muse giving this land to the church Whenever you call for a function to finish the construction, I'll happily be part of the team so that we can do what we can. Lastly, Nduguzetu wa Kenya, Ugonjo wa Corona, Hauna Mchezo. Sisi katika bunge, this term we have lost close to 10 members. Hatujaesabu wanainje ambao uko nje wengine majina yao hatujui. Tafadhali mujilinde magovernors wetu ile pesa imetoka national government the least you can do nunulia wanainji hizi vitu za mapua ili wawe safe from a disease whose origin we still don't know whose effect on our bodies we still don't know and whose efficacy from the vaccinations we are getting we still don't know to Jilinde we need everybody a person dying in Transoya is a person dying in Mombasa a person dying in Mandera is a person dying in Kisumu we are all Kenyans we must be each other's keeper Baba Etemesi Kule wanapoenda ndiyo njia yetu. Biblia inasema kusaliwa ni bahati kifo ni lazima kwa sisi zote. The only thing we don't know and we thank God for keeping this secret from humanity forever that nobody knows when they will die. If people go to know they will destroy this country and the whole world so that they can live without caring what is left behind. God bless you, Baba. We love you. We believed in you. And we shall forever believe in your legacy.